Testies, 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 testing the microphone. Actually got really hot in here. I was like cold and then I put this on and now I think I need to take it off. This, um, I got asked a lot about the other day on Instagram stories. As you can see, this is the only part that's kind of like not looking so great on this, but it's got pockets. This I feel like was a little bit of an overpriced item that I bought because I didn't know where else to get it and I loved it and it's so soft. Like once you touch it, you're like, yes, that needs to be mine. I need it on my body. So I bought it at Abercrombie for $85 and I think a little bit high. I just realized that you can see my plug in the wall down here. Oh well. Tonight I'm gonna take my ass to the movies. There is a movie called Freaky. That's a spin, like a horror comedy spin on Freaky Friday, except instead of switching places with her mother, she switches places with a serial killer. So I'm gonna go to the movies. It's kind of like a thing that I like to do. I like to take myself to the movies. I find it empowering, I find it fun. And so I figured I would film this before because I've had a chance for the most part to try everything we're gonna talk about in this video. So I was on uh, YouTube like a few months ago and I found this girl named Katie Musser. I think I'm saying that right. Um, she's really cute. She does these videos where she talks about Amazon products you've got to have. I watched one of her recent ones and bought almost everything on her list. Some of them I didn't purchase because they just didn't pertain to me or I already have something similar to that. So this video is trying out her favorites and I'm going to include some of my own also that I purchased um, outside of, like while I was shopping for the ones that she had on her list, I saw some other ones I was like, oh, I need that. So the number one thing I'm gonna talk about, it, or the first thing I'm gonna talk about, I guess, is the Way Chill Pills. So these are bath bombs. I really liked the directions. I thought that they were kind of like snarky and funny. They smell absolutely amazing. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I paid this much for these. $30 for six of these is insane. These are just meant to like relax you basically. A breath of fresh hair. They've got jojoba, safflower, and hemp seed oils. I'll tell you another reason why I didn't like these and I have a funny story for you. It's gonna make me sound like a total idiot, but it's come full circle. So these come in little plastic plastic things like this. And the instructions, they're like perforated. You can't really tell because it's too bright, but they're perforated, not the plastic, but the chunk inside. And it says to break that in half and then throw it in the bath. Recently, my dishwasher hasn't been working super great. I have these like little packs that go in the dishwasher and they're covered in plastic and the repair guy came and he goes, show me how you do this. Like, show me how you're doing this. Like, I know it seems silly, just show me. Okay, so I take a little stupid thing and I start unpeeling it. it. Takes me like 15 minutes and he's laughing at me. I'm like, why are you laughing, dude? And he's like, you're not supposed to peel that out of a little bag, that bag disintegrates. And I was like, Okay, I'm gonna go jump off a bridge now. So apparently that's why my shit hasn't been getting cleaned as it should. So for $30, I really feel like they need to like go the extra mile and source that plastic that can't be that expensive if, 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 if it's on dishwasher tablets. I, I don't recommend these. My body did feel very soft after my bath, but so does it when I just squirt any type of soap in the water ever. So this next item is something that I need badly because I have very dry lips. I actually really think the packaging of this is super cute too. So this is I Do Care Blush Party Lip Balm. It comes with this like little spatula that you're never gonna use ever. This actually works really well. I love lip balm. I have to keep it on basically 24 seven because I have very dry lips. I like how much product it comes with. The packaging is really cute. This was $16 and um, you can apply a little coupon right now on Amazon, 30% off. Yeah, I do really like this. I think this is great. I'm not sure if you knew this, but Amazon is a really great place to buy like super cute sunglasses. I purchased these off of Katie's list. When I got them, I realized that they were not my style. Um, I realized that these are very in style, but they're too thin for me. Like, no, I just, don't, I can't pull these off. Like, they were $9.99. So very inexpensive, love Amazon for sunglasses, except not the style for me. Next we have some jewelry. So the earrings I have on right now, actually, these are the ones that I purchased. I can't remember if these are the same ones from her video or if I kind of like did a spider web around Amazon and found these, but these were only $7.99. And um, I just love new earrings. I think it's always something that's like pretty cheap to buy but can really make a difference. Like if I don't take the time to get ready during the day, 
I'd love to add on a little bit of jewelry and earrings because it really does like make you look more put together. So I have my ears, I used to have my ears gauged, so they kind of like don't look that cute, especially without earrings. So I like to buy earrings off of Amazon because they're so affordable and they usually are like very lightweight because they're cheap as f this is a candle from Sweetwater Decor called Hello Fall, number 17. This smells so good. It's cider, nutmeg, cinnamon, and cloves, and that's exactly what it smells like. Like all of the Thanksgivings in my childhood is like in this candle. Currently unavailable. Oh, shit. Well, I'll link a couple others for you guys. It actually came in this really nice packaging, and the company itself looks super cute. I went to their website, and you can buy candles directly from there too, so I'll link their website as well. I'm like kind of cheap when it comes to candles. If you saw my vlog going to Bath & Body Works, you know. This one smells amazing. I'm really bummed out that it's not available. But this was $24, and that's too much money for me. <laughs> I would never buy a candle for $24 if I wasn't buying it off of Katie's list. So personally, I would wait till there's a sale. I'm also gonna do a giveaway in this video and I didn't mention that at the beginning. So all of the OG people who are still watching, we're gonna keep this one for you guys. So I'm gonna give away a bag that I'm gonna talk about in this video and when we get there, I'll tell you. Okay, so this item that I purchased, I actually, it's downstairs in my closet, I forgot to grab it, but I wanted to show it to you. It's $30.99. It, it, I get so many compliments when I wear this. Um, it is this cute little cardigan that I just love it. It goes with almost everything. You can actually apply a coupon for this one too and it's um, $2 off when you apply that little coupon. I bought some sports bras for Amazon and I actually have recently, per not I shouldn't say recently, it was a long time ago before my boob job, but recently I actually wore them because I was saving them to do a video on and then after I got my boob job, I was like, it's been, this has been way too long. Like this probably isn't even available on Amazon anymore. I don't even remember where I got them. So then I just started using them and not so bad actually. So it really depends where you buy it on Amazon. This was one of the ones mentioned in Katie's video, 1619. The pads are really thick and cheap feeling, which I didn't like. And maybe I just need a smaller size, but this band, as you can see, is like wider at the very bottom, which I feel like that should be kind of one of the tighter places. This one, I wasn't a huge fan of. The material is actually pretty like harsh too. Harsh, it's kind of like hard. I mean, it's only $16, but TJ Maxx has $16 sports bras that are like way nicer. This next one is from a different brand and I could be mistaken. Maybe this is the one from Katie's video and that's one I found. So this one is $15 and 14 cents and it's a similar aesthetic. Like the pads are way thinner and less stiff in this one. So this one already feels a lot better and you can see it straight up and down on the sides. It doesn't go out like that. So I haven't actually tried this one on at the gym, but I will. This one just overall already feels a lot nicer and it's a little bit cheaper. So I would go with this one if I were you. The next couple items are some books that were on Katie's list that I purchased. I have one that I actually like better and I'm gonna share that with you guys after. So this one is Let That Shit Go. It's $8.99. It's a journal for leaving your bullshit behind and creating a happy life. I started filling this one out. My name is on here. And then I started doing this page where you basically write in pen certain things that you don't like that you're doing. And then you put like the good ones and bigger stuff. One of the reasons why I this book isn't for me is because I'm just way too too busy to, to, to commit to this type of thing. Another one is um, a year of positive thinking, daily inspiration and courage. So this isn't anything you have to do, like you don't have to write anything down. You just open it and you read. So we'll read today's, cause I haven't read this since I bought it. You cannot change the past. You cannot change the past, it is done. Leave it behind you rather than allowing it to anchor you in, a, in place and keep you from moving forward. There is hope in looking forward and freedom in letting go. You deserve to have both. So this is actually really cute. I should put this um, at my sink. This is, these are like cute little stocking stuffers. Like, are you the type of person that wants to journal and write things down and like think about things and like whatever, or you just want to quick read something? The other one that I'm gonna share with you right now is kind of like a little bit of both. I just checked on Amazon and they do still have this. So they have one 
specifically for moms, a day for the soul. So they have different versions of this. This one is 10.99. Uh, it says given to me by, I, I wrote, I like how I wrote my own thing in there so I know who gave it to me and what year. Given to me by Karen and Ray, Christmas 2015. So on June 21st, um, it says, I don't know if you see, so you fill in the year basically and it'll ask you a question up here and then you fill in the year and write your answer in here and then as you go, you can read your old answers. 2016, it says, who do you want to know better? I just like randomly pulled this one, by the way. It says, my husband, you can try, but there's always more to learn. Boy, was there more to learn. <laughs> so this is a great one. I keep this next to my sink in my bathroom. This one's actually, I think was from Mylis. I'm getting this confused now, sorry. So what? whatever, her video will be linked, but this one is the five minute journal. And it was um, $24.99, tools to positively change your life. Basically, you write the date at the top and then like this one says, I am grateful for, and then you put one, two, three, and it has a quote from Martin Luther uh, King Jr. And then what would make today great, daily affirmations. This is another cute one, um, $24.99, a little bit higher end, so you might be better off with some of the others, but definitely still cute. Next is something that you are going to love, I think, because I love it. I am a sucker for slippers. I go through them often. I work at home, I'm home all day long. So I basically live in slippers. However, my feet sweat a lot. And most slippers are made out of like shitty polyester material and your feet sweat a lot. So these, they are gonna get dirty probably pretty quickly, but one thing that I do like about these is that they're open toed. So my fat Flintstone toes have a little bit of air and room to breathe, so they don't quite sweat as much. The fact that they're so, they have such good tread on the bottom, you can wear these like outside to take out the trash, whatever. Um, these are $23.99 and they come in lots of different colors. So if you're not a fan of pink, there is another shade for you. I pulled this out of the dirty clothes for you guys. Um, here's a picture so you can see what it looks like on because it's crumpled up and smelly right now. So this was $27.99. It's just a really cute, like off the shoulder, like little top. And it's got the little scrunchie at the bottom. It doesn't feel like the most expensive thing in the world, but it isn't. Okay, for that giveaway, let's talk about that. Okay, this is a perfect giveaway to do because this product or item is actually like not available right now. I paid around $45 for it. It is an Aldo purse and it's got this big, vegan fluff ball on it. And this totally looks like a designer purse. And this is what I'm gonna give away. It has the strap on the inside. That's why I left it all like this, but it's got this like one right here. So if whatever you need to keep separated and quickly get to is right there. And then it also has a clip or a, a little zipper in the back so you can put some stuff in there, phone, whatever. I like the black. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this away. Let's see, all you guys need to do, I'm like making this up on the fly. Um, all you need to do is go ahead and follow me on Instagram and follow me here on, or subscribe here on YouTube and leave a black heart in the emoji, or like a black heart emoji in the comments and I will choose a winner uh, to get this about three days after the video goes up and I'll ship it out to you. So this is gonna be available for US and Canada only. Um, I don't want this to get lost uh, shipping. That's happened to me a few times recently, mailing random things here and there. So I'm gonna do US and Canada only. I'm so sorry, but um, good luck. I will announce the winner in three days. I think that's everything from Katie's list. And now we're gonna move on to some of my stuff. I only have a few things left. So, but you're gonna wanna hear these because these things are awesome. This next thing is a perfect little gift to go in a stocking or like to couple with something else. So this is a silicone heat resistant pad. It's like this on both sides and it also opens up like so. The reason why I love this is because whenever I travel, I'm always rushing to get out the door when we're headed to the airport and typically I've just turned off my curling iron. And so that way you can take it out and put it inside of this and put it in your suitcase without melting or burning anything in your suitcase. And then this is also really great for if I'm filming a YouTube video and I don't wanna burn something on my desk, I'll just set this down. This will definitely be awesome for you if you use hot tools. Let's talk about some hair stuff. This is a waver, like a wand waver. What do you call them? What do, what do they call this? Curl, three barrel curling 
iron wand dual voltage hair crimper. It's not a crimper, this is a waiver. I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> this is $31.99 and there's a $2 off coupon on Amazon. Um, you can control the temperature right here on this guy. I love that it's pink. It gives my hair like a really nice wave. I should probably do like an Instagram tutorial using this to show you guys like it works well. This wand is another, it's actually looks like it's made by the same company. Maybe it is, I don't really know. This is $40 and you can choose the barrel size that you want. You can see how that kind of works out. So this works really well. The only thing to say about this one is that there's only an on and off switch and you cannot control the temperature and I didn't actually realize that. That's the only downside to this. I feel like for $40, this should definitely be able to tell you the temp. This last item I actually purchased on a different Amazon account because it's a business expense. So I don't remember the exact price, but I think it was around $35. This thing is awesome. This is a Logitech keyboard. This thing is so rad. There is an on button on the back. It takes batteries. I wish it was like rechargeable, which would be cool. There are three settings right here. So you can do this and pair it to different devices. For instance, I have my iPad on one. I have my phone on one. I really like that it's like an old school type. Like it reminds me of like when I was little using like that VTech, like little keyboard, what, whatever thing. And so I really like this because if I'm sitting down to have breakfast or something, I will just pop my phone right in here like that. And I'll respond to comments on Instagram, YouTube, whatever. And I don't have to bring my laptop with me or if I'm like texting someone and they don't have an iPhone and I can't text them from my computer or my laptop, I'll put stick it in here if I like have a lot to say or whatever. This works with PC and iOS. So it works with Android, Windows, Chrome, etc. And there is a little button on here to actually, you can still do like emojis and stuff. You just click it and they pop up. I wouldn't say it's super light, but I wouldn't say it's super heavy either. If like, if someone's on the phone a lot, you should buy this for them as a gift. That is everything that I purchased from Katie's List and some of my own stuff in there. What were your favorite items that you saw? Have you purchased any of this? Let me know in the comments below. I can't wait to chat with you guys. Thanks for watching. And I'd like to do another one of these for December. Um, so if you guys are enjoying these types of videos and you like to see what I like to spend my money on on Amazon, then I'm always down to sit here and talk about it. It gives me an excuse to go shopping on Amazon too. So that's always nice. But thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, good luck with the contest and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.